Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is I love colors. And guys, today we are drawing Rafiki, Rafiki from Lion King and even color in it. And this is a long video and you are going to enjoy your time out here with me drawing and coloring this cute little monkey from Lion King. It's like my childhood animation movie. I don't know if you have seen it or not, but I tell you, you gotta watch this movie. This movie is very inspirational and like very different kind of movie. It was like very first animation movie that I saw, I guess. And uh, right now it's hard for me to find out uh, where to get this movie. It's like um, in YouTube, if I search about it, it's it's like they don't have uh, the entire movie out there. But YouTube shows me a lot of movies though. YouTube shows me a lot of animation movies, family movies, kids movie, romantic movie. But it doesn't show me no Lion King entire movie. So I will have to like search internet and uh, gotta find out from where I can get this movie. But we can draw this Rafiki as I can find his photo and uh, right now you see me drawing his nose like i tell you whenever you get an animal uh, or any cute character that you have uh, whichever is your favorite you should start from the very center of his um, of this drawing like you can start with his nose at times or you can start from his belly if his belly is at the center and right now I'm using this uh, black sketch pen and it is making some good permanent marks and I've got a whole lot of colors as you can see like oh, a whole lot of color can be added to it but this character has very nice set of colors like blue, red, and it is like this. This photo that I'm drawing, it is like all funny and like all nice. So you are gonna enjoy this guy's drawing, and you can just follow along with me. Like you just grab your paper and grab a sketch pen, and if you haven't started yet, you can just draw it right now. You can just use a marker or your HP pencil and without any worry just start man just pick the marker just pick just just get some white paper and just start with me and like you're gonna enjoy look I'm making some wrong marks as well here and there and what I try to do is uh, I I pick a point first like like I see the picture the picture is right in front of me which I'm drawing right now and uh, this is not from memory at all <laughs> because I don't remember Rafiq that well I'm like trying to get him his energy and his like his vibe right now so I want him to be around as I have not been drawing myself and I miss my childhood and like all the movies that I enjoyed so this is one character one movie that I loved and like I remember and I have like their drawings around me so I like drawing them and this is a very good look at his beard he got some beard and it's like all wavy <laughs> And he's a monkey, and if you are feeling like monkey, then it is awesome because I'm mostly in a monkey mood. <laughs> and monkeys are awesome. Have you encountered monkey till now? Have you seen any monkey around your house? Because I'm from India, and out here there are so many monkeys. <laughs> I see them a lot like there is this one place that I go for a 
hike and out there I see monkeys jumping from one tree to the other and they are like playing with dogs or I don't know running away from dogs sometimes dogs are their best friends and sometimes dogs are like about to bite them and like bite their butt <laughs> and then <laughs> are not in the mood to play <laughs> so monkeys are like jumping from one tree to another tree and then uh, these monkeys got red red butt <laughs> i guess maybe because of that dogs are like running after them Whoa, what the what the hell is that this animal is like weird like he got some red red butt <laughs> and now i'm drawing the eye so what we do with the eye is like right now i did make a mistake here like i i totally forgot that i gotta um, look at the look at the bottom of the eye to make a uh, right mark but but later on in this video i will correct it so what i did was i just went ahead and I kept on drawing like I just did not make any mistake and so yeah I suggest you also to do the same like if you feel like there is something wrong that you did right now just forget about it just carry on with your thing and later on you can correct it I got a white marker like white correction pen with me here so i corrected it later on and so you can see like his face is coming out right now like when you draw the eyes what starts happening is the actual image is like trying to come out so i mostly try to make the eyes later on like leave the eyes later on so that it's like a very nice reveal for me whenever i draw a sketch i don't draw the eyes first even I suggest you to like never draw the eyes first. It's like very amazing when it when you reach the eye at the very end of the sketch or your drawing session. It's really amazing when you reveal the eye at the very end because it it feels like this uh, this drawing just came to life right now and and drawing hairs is like very amazing. They are all wavy and not perfect and going from left to right right to left and and yep I, I miss drawing hairs this guy got some very cool funky hair <laughs> and he's like the guide in the movie you know the main character of the movie is Simba like Simba is a young lion who has just entered the jungle and like he is with his dad who is like really strong and like he's trying to teach Simba how to like how who we are and like what we do how we do it and like this guy is his guide Simba's guide and like Sim Simba is like around him a lot of time and like is questioning him a lot of things and he's like he's like an old guy this this guy's name is Rafiki and Rafiki is very old and like Rafiki old people like you must be having a grandfather or grandma around and they are like really very old and you look at them and you feel like oh my god they are so different I'm so different my hands look different their hands look so different and when you talk to them they got so many stories and like they got so many so many things that you don't know about they know so much so it's just the same with this guy Rafiki is like very old and Simba is very young and like he is he is like learning and if you're enjoying do subscribe yeah I love colors if you love colors do subscribe <laughs> and
so that we can keep on talking because I want to talk to you. And and the thing is that Rafiki, Rafiki is like very. Rafiki is like very old and like he's having one stick with him. Like he walks with his uh, um, back bended all forward and like he's like, oh, oh my God, his eyes are here. Uh, right now, not even made his uh, tongue and teeth. But this is the guy. This is Rafiki. This is monkey. Mm. Monkey, a different kind of monkey. That is, monkeys have like a lot of. Um, there are so many types of monkeys, and we call them like their species. Like there are a lot of species, and yeah, when we talk about monkeys. And like one of them is uh, called man mandrill. One is one is called baboon. One is called they all come in uh, mammalians. If you know about them, like we have animals then mammals then reptiles they're mammalians and mammalians have fur all over their bodies and they got four limbs just like us like two hands two legs they're like pretty nice i used to get very scared of monkeys you know when i was a kid as my uh, neighborhood was like uh, my neighborhood was always having monkeys around and they would uh, in general they would not just be around a lot but they would be like once in a while they would come and they would come in a huge amount and just like dogs like dogs are like around us a lot of are uh, like you must be having a dog right now or your friend must be having a dog but maybe your friend must not be having a monkey and you might not have seen no monkeys around and same was with me like no, no none of my friends was having monkeys <laughs> and they would be like some sort of wild animal in a way because they are not around nobody is having them and because of that, there was a kind of fear that I had, and whenever I would see them like out here in India, what would happen is uh, uh, there are temples, like a lot of temples here. People worship this Lord Shiva, and there are so many gods here, but the Shiva is the main god out here, and like so, he has a lot of temples, and. When we go there, you like I always see monkeys around, and like there are always monkeys around temples. Maybe because they feed them, because there is a, like food source out there. That's why they are there. Maybe because they like the sound of bells, because temples have a lot of bells, and like because of that, they are like out there. They're enjoying the sound of the bell and they like being around people and crowd or maybe just because temples are in uh, places which are like very fertile. If you know fertile, fertile is like which is the soil is very good and the there are there is greenery all around. And like there is a whole lot of plants and animals and good weather and some food is always available on the trees or things like that. Maybe just because of that monkeys are always around. And always I always see temples are in 
these kind of places only like they are very fertile and like the soil is very rich and like are you enjoying are you have you got your colors out have you got your crayons out now by now like look he is looking awesome look at his eyes he's like all oh excited <laughs> his eyes are so excited his mouth is all open and like his he's excited to see you and me <laughs> and like it's amazing that's why i'm sketching this guy this guy looks so amazing and he is like so funny <laughs> and look i corrected his uh, eye now you can't even see it's like looking like some sort of reflection on his eye and like there is some sort of um light that is falling on his eyes and it's amazing and so yep what i was telling you were then monkeys i would see monkeys around temples here in india and if you have ever been to india oh that is very nice because uh i love india india is awesome and india. india is very beautiful and india indian people are very awesome they uh out here there are so many types of people that i've met from different countries to indians to to there are so many type of languages here i don't know if you have so many languages around your place or not but here in india we got a lot of languages here and we got a lot of monkeys <laughs> in different places <laughs> and and we got stories about monkeys you know one god we got a god who is monkey and like <laughs> and he got super powers <laughs> we call him hanuman <laughs> and he is like super strong <laughs> and and whenever i used to go to temples i would see him around he got his own prayers like if you if you want extra energy in your life and like extra strength you sing his prayers and you get extra energy <laughs> and it is called hanuman chalisa and it's amazing you know monkeys are very good and we got stories about him we got we got different different stories about him and and he is like very different like when you when i go to temples what happens is like there are human gods and then there is one god who is like all blue in color and then one god who is like having a lot of snakes around him and like one god is like uh is having a lot of uh, horses around him and like he is always on this um, um carriage i guess you call it carriage or a, a cart or like a yeah, carriage i would say like carriage or a cart in which he is being i don't know i think so i'm making a mistake here but he's like like he is on this old fashion ride and he got like uh, horses pulling him and 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 it's very different and then you see one god who is like all monkey man monkey plus human mix and like it is very weird at times to see look at him and like and try to understand like how how can this be possible man 
or how this must have how how this story was created but i accept it and i accept god stories and like try to understand things about them and like so yep i you like mm, sketching out things with me or not huh this is amazing i got some dark blue color now this guy got rafiki got two different color shades here and this is like his eye and look how i color it like how i am coloring is like i make the outline first i don't make uh, i don't go too fast i don't go too slow i slowly slowly take it like i slowly slowly and if you're enjoying do like the video and so you have made the outline of the sketch so what i do is like i first color over the outlines so what happens is like then my color will not go outside that line and same goes like i first made the outside of this eye now i'm like making a mark on the inside of the eye and like so that it doesn't go inside the eye and like voila <laughs> it is completed it is like the eyes are completed like, look he's like looking so nice and like, his colors are so good i'm like enjoying sketching this guy is how oh, then like now his forehead is all gray and like so i've grabbed my color and I'm like just making the outline yeah as i told you like i am coloring his out uh, forehead outline first so that i don't make a mistake of going out of that line and same you can try the same or if you have your own way you please carry on nobody is stopping you buddy you are awesome <laughs> <laughs> and i just enjoy making this guy and like i'm making this so that i get into my cartoonish artistic mode and like get into the good feeling and look how i'm scribbling it right now like after making that outline you know like i know that there is a, a whole lot of space now that i have to color So now I'm like scribbling it everywhere. Da na 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 na. Boom 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 boom. And da da. <laughs> This forehead is completed, <laughs> and I did not make no mistakes. That is amazing. Like over there in the forehead, I'm there is a little red coming out from his nose though. <laughs> But still, I guess oh, at that time I wasn't doing it like that. and the sketch is like half done right now and in in middle i did go and make his um uh, tongue also like earlier and start i was uh, i did not color his tongue and you know look man how nice he got brown uh, jaw and cheeks and he got red red nose and he got amazing smile big long stretchy smile and he got spikes if you like spikes it's awesome monkeys like spikes <laughs> and this guy is having this black spikes very little black spikes and it's awesome and i am just filling his hair because he's old and rest of his hair or uh, rest of his ha- hairs are white he got just only that much amount of black hair left and 
<laughs> I'm Indian and like I have all black hair. I don't know what color of hair do you have. But I know it is cute. But it is gonna be cute. Because I like a lot of colors. And I've seen people with like green color hair. Brown color hair. Gray color hair. And then I was like even studying about it, like how how do people have so many different kind of colors, different kind of uh, colors in their hair, and like what makes it like that, and why do I have black hairs, and like not everyone has black hair, and I uh, I used to uh, wonder when I was a kid, like. Um, why do I don't have like different color hair and like enjoying my own hair is like you know, would, would become a little difficult at times because you at times you start liking somebody else's hairs and this and that and it is very foolish you should always like your own hairs and if you got green hair and someone else got black hair don't you worry you are very awesome and cute and amazing and <laughs> just like Rafiki Rafiki got black hair but he got like a lot of white hair but he doesn't care he's like smiling right now <laughs> he's all happy about me sketching him <laughs> and right now I'm drawing the inside of his mouth like inside of the mouth is mostly dark you can't see in there so there is like I'm feeling some gray dark gray color there and like I'm using this plastic crayons if you got plastic crayons they are amazing isn't it like don't buy no oil crayons don't tell your parents or mama to buy you oil crayons like plastic crayons are amazing Plastic crayons, I love plastic crayons and wax crayons. And now I got this big marker to fill up the outside of the car sketch. And now I'm making that same kind of thing like covering the outline first or going close to the outline as this oh, big marker is going to fill the space pretty quickly and and look how it is looking amazing this yellow color is so good and it's like complimenting the uh, cartoon and Rafiki got white hair and all the colors that I was supposed to fill are filled in and this is the only color that was left like to make to pop the art like i am trying to pop this art right now like get the art of this monkey or get this drawing looking more beautiful and i thought like why not just color the background a little so what will happen is like his face will pop out of the page and by the end of this drawing you will see that his face is like literally popping out now and so it's amazing like i love this big marker this big marker fills the space very quickly and and i bought it to make murals wall murals but when i went there out there to make a wall mural what happened was like these markers were not working pretty nicely they were they were like good for paper only so I thought of using it here this will be like helpful these are like 15 mm size markers they quickly fill the space and sketch pens are nice isn't it like these sketch pens they are like filling the color up and, and it's awesome yellow color is very nice i love yellow color i love i'm missing a yellow 
t-shirt i want to buy one yellow t-shirt wearing yellow color is like very nice sunny sunny all sunny sunny and bright bright and awesome isn't it like now look it's like this guy is like popping out and like he's looking very nice and and the entire area is also like covered and like I did not go very specific and like coloring it very properly but when I do it till the time I am not satisfied and like whenever I feel like okay now I think so Rafiki hairs are all visible his ears are well visible all brown ears so then I stopped and then I filled the entire background and I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you again next time alright take care buddy